Strangers from distant lands, friends of old. You've been summoned here to answer the threat of Mordor. Middle-earth stands upon the brink of destruction. Bring forth the ring. Jack, you do have the ring, don't you? Yes. Yes, I, I have the ring. The thing is, last night me and some buddies had a little too much mead, and uh, well, we ended up at the piercing parlor. <laughs> And, uh, long story short... Oh, my God. It's a gift. You're damn right it's a gift. It's called the Prince Albert, and it's my precious. So... You're telling us that you took the fabled ring of Sauron, the one ring that could destroy all of Middle Earth, and attached it to your your little hobbit there? It was easy. See, what they do is they heat up this metal spike, and then they drive it through your penis. Uh, uh, and then they just wiggle it around a little bit to make sure the hole's big enough. And then they just put a hinge on the ring, snap it shut. Boom, it's on there forever, baby. That's disgusting. You say that now. This little bad boy gets the ladies where they're trying to go every time. The ring is destroyed. Yo, eyebrows, stay out of this. Jack, none of us are comfortable with the fate of Middle Earth dangling from your... Oh, my God, it's moving. The ring must be destroyed. Okay, fine. I'm taking it off. Gee, Louise. Can't get it off. Maybe somebody should help him with that? Oh, for God's sake, somebody help him. down the axe. You know, I knew you guys wouldn't be supportive. Gimli, when you wanted to grow a beard, we all said it would look dumb, but you did it anyway, and now you've got a cool Rob Zombie thing going on. And Elrond, the headband, it's a little 1983, but that's cool. And Frodo, you remember when... Frodo? Yo, Frodo. Eyes up here. Jack. You're right. None of us have been very supportive. And it is a very attractive piercing. Is it okay if I uh, take a closer look? But of course, milady. You might notice the fine craftsmanship. <laughs> okay. Let's get this bitch to Mount Doom.